We have ways to make you talk. Muchachos, today I'm doing Darwiner Schnitzels. We have ways to make you talk. Blazing bacon guacamole schnitzel sandwich. Wee, 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 wee. Sounds pretty good, huh? The blazing bacon guacamole schnitzel sandwich. That's a lot. Schnitzel is basically veal, but they're doing chicken. So they have their new chicken sandwiches. They have like a, a ranch sandwich. Uh, chicken ranch they have um, some other thingy but we're doing the blazing bacon guacamole veal or chicken sandwich here um look at all the good uh, all the accoutrements on here it looks pretty swinging stuff you got a bun here and chicken well, check this out okay youtubers the wiener schnitzel's new chicken schnitzel sandwiches will be available at participating locations through June 25th, 2017. And they're gonna come out three varieties. The classic ranch, barbecue bacon, and the blazing bacon guacamole, which we have today. Wee, 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 wee. Um, the blazing bacon guacamole um, comes out to like $4.49. And it's got a chicken uh, filet, blazing sauce, guacamole, bacon, lettuce, and tomato. All at the Wiener Schnitzel. Wee, 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 wee. So what do you think about that? Muchachos and muchachos. Pretty neat stuff, huh? So that Wiener Schnitzel, we have this to make you talk. Anyways, um, so instead of doing, nobody's gonna want to have a veal burger. So that's why they went with chicken. Chicken schnitzel. So here we go, everyone. This is the new chicken schnitzel. Um, blazing bacon guacamole sandwich from Dalvina Schnitzel. Oh my God. <laughs> mm hmm. Mmm. 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 Wow, pretty good. I know it's like a trend now is like guacamole. They have it now at Mickey D's. And now here at that Wiener Schnitzel. So, first off, Right off the bat, I taste that blazing sauce. Is it blazing? On a scale of one to four, four is like volcano. One is like nothing. This is like a 1.5. So it doesn't kill the flavor of the chicken patty, the chicken filet, which is pretty good. Um, it's probably, it's not as moist I would like it to be. It's probably a little overcooked. You know, they were just right there. They should just like, probably like 30 seconds less. Anyways. But the um, the guacamole tastes fine. Uh, the crunchiness of the lechuga is good. It's nice, ice and cold. They're using a uh, iceberg lechuga and a tomato. Um, the only thing that kind of is weird on this, I don't like the bun. I wish they had an artisan bun. You know, it's kind of like a you know, it's like a day old bun. You know, kind of like. But you know, they're into hot dogs, so they're not gonna have like. We need like a ton of hamburger buns. They're gonna sell more hot dog buns and hamburger buns and I understand and I get that. So I'm not gonna, you know, I wish, I wish the bun would have been more of an artisan bun, more of a, like a brioche, something softer. And so that would have been probably made it taste a lot better. So let me see. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the chicken's not salty at all. It's seasoned really good. So all in all, I, I love the combination of guacamole and chicken. My favorite thing to eat is chicken tacos with guacamole. Wee, 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 wee. So good. So this is a good little sandwich. Would I get this again? You know, I would. I would. I'm not lying. I would. 
Because I like guacamole and chicken. I love that combination. It's like peas and carrots and baseball and hot dogs and um, I don't know, who what else? Um, what's that guy's name? Like the Titanic on the iceberg. It's the same thing. So, wow, this is not bad. Uh, so what would I change? Like I said, I would have put a, a nice brioche bun on this. I would have liked a little bigger chicken filet on here, a little thicker. A little, a little, it would have been nicer to get a little bigger size. But all in all, it's not bad. On a scale of one to ten, I'm gonna give this an eight. Beep, 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 beep. For the blazing bacon guacamole schnitzel the sandwich, we have ways to make you talk. And that'll be in your schnitzel. Woo, 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 woo. Check out my tweets and my twerks and everything in between. Share, like, and subscribe to my channel, Joey's World Tour. It's going to walk because of you. Um, follow me on Instagram. And if you'd like a Joey's World Tour t-shirt, check out my Spreadshirt shop, and you'll find the link below. Anyways, you guys are the best. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. It's growing because of you. Thank you so much. Anyways, this is Joe for Joey's Super Cool Food Review saying peace. <laughs>